on 8 Napa in Westport. So the, the situation here is we were considering starting planting over that post right there and taking over to where the cedar tree is right here. So it's about 100 linear feet of planting. The lawn, we were going to try to push back about another four to five feet from this point going back, extend the lawn. And you still have about 14 feet wide by 100 feet of planting area going through this area. Okay. Um, so that's, that's one area for planting. Then you've got a ledge over here. So the idea would be to expose the ledge, power wash it, um, plant some ground cover or perennials kind of in some of the crevices of the ledge. Um, plant privacy trees. Plant privacy trees starting at the fence over there. Going over here, which is another, call it almost another 100 linear feet. Um, and then have a buffer of smaller dwarf plantings between the ledge and the trees. I would suggest using potentially uh, an arborvitae. I'll give you a few options as far as sizes that could work in there. And this would all be lawn going through this way. Potentially, potentially a patio sitting area in here with a, with a gas fire pit. Um, the fence is going to extend naturally back in this corner. So you'd still need to add some lawn in this area. It looks like you might still have a stump right there. You might have to grind still. See that one potential? You have to outside check on that. Um, so that's, that's basically the backyard. Hey, how you doing? Good, good. Do a mulch ring around the tree, the dogwood tree. This is going to be a fence that comes through here that goes to and finishes almost at this door. So that's another 30 feet of fence, linear feet. You, I think you're going to need to put some plantings like a hedge around here. Okay. If your generator is there, usually your fence has to be a minimum two feet off the generator. So you're going to be almost, call it, eight, nine feet off the house by the time your fence is installed. Then this is all gonna be lawn going through here. So that's another uh, 55 feet times 12 feet on average. You know, a little piece of lawn section in here. And then we redo all the plants in the front. On my previous video that I was here from the other day, I, I counted all the plants. I'll send you both videos, even though the backyard plan has changed a little bit. But again, we can reuse all these plants and transplant these. Same thing here. And on the other video, I talked about plantings in front of the fence there as an option. Putting your garbage cans behind that fence. You don't have to look at them in front of the house. And then making this area smaller and, and again thinking about the plants for this area. So that's it. So we'll, um, I appreciate the opportunity. We'll chat soon.